Hi, this is Teresa Robertson. I'm just struggling right now with my uh, insulin pins malfunction. I sent it to the pharmacist. They can't get me none right now until the 6th of October. I, I'm struggling with that right now, and I need some help on how I can get a hold of the insurance company to do an override so I can get my insulin pins to last me till the 6th of October. And if you don't have this medication, how is that gonna impact you? I will be sick. My blood sugar will go up. It won't be at 129 like it is now, and they're stable. And if I don't have the insulin, my blood sugar goes up. What is the point that, um some final thoughts that you want to help drive home about um, Medicaid in Arkansas. What do you want to help to advocate for? I want to advocate, and I want to do this, not only say this for my mom that's 70 years old, that can't get up and do for herself right now, but she's rehabilitating herself every day. I see it. I see the progress, you know. But I'm also advocating for these other people that don't have no family to stand up for them. They need someone that's strong enough, willing to stand up and speak for them on whoever it is. That they need the help too. And they need to just go to somebody that they can say, hey, I'm dealing with this, help me. You know, what can I do? How can y'all help me? What's the resources you got? That's the advocacy I'm looking for. For these people that can't get up, I can still get up. I have mobility issues, but I can still get up and walk to my place with this. There's somebody out there can't even get a walker, a wheelchair, a power chair because they don't have the insurance and they don't know how to get it.